All right, so in this video, I'm gonna go over exactly how to use Apollo to build a lead list. So if you are doing any type of B2B outreach, you know, you've probably heard of Apollo. So uh, let's just get right into it. So obviously the first thing you wanna do is just create an account. Um, what I like to start off with when I build a list is first going to the email status and pressing verified, just so I don't even waste my time with a bunch of unverified ones. The next thing I want to do, so let's say, you know, in, in our example, uh, you know, we help marketing agencies get more clients. So for our clients, clearly we don't want to reach out to other marketing agencies. So what we'll do when I'm starting off is go in the company or industry keywords and then press advanced settings is not marketing and advertising. And, you know, for so for whatever type of offer it is that you have or whatever industry it is that you have, you know, you probably aren't wanting to reach out to your competitors. So you can start off there and just adjust it, you know, for your industry. So now that we have that taken care of, I'll also go in here and add in some company keywords as, you know, to exclude. You know, because just because sometimes it doesn't pick up all of all of the keywords. Um, so let's just say, okay, so it's not changing, so it's already good there. All right, so location. Uh, for this campaign, it's just going to be the United States. Um, and then so in this example, uh, we're going to be going after uh, people in the death industry. So like funeral, uh, funeral companies um, or, you know, funeral homes, cremation services, etc. So I'm going to go back in the industry keywords. I'm gonna to go to company keywords specifically for this because there's no uh, industry here, at least for Apollo. But this is how you find, you know, these more niche industries. So I'm gonna type in general cremation. Okay, and then and close this out. All right, so next, job titles. So when you're creating, when you're thinking about job titles to use, I mean, uh, just think about how big the company is. Generally, for smaller companies, you're just gonna wanna reach out to the owner or the CEO for bigger companies. Depending on what you're selling, of course, you might wanna reach out to a very specific job title. So if you're reaching out to a big company, you know, with over, let's say, 100 employees, you're probably, if you're selling marketing, you're probably going to reach out to the marketing director, not the owner, because owner is probably not going to handle that, right? So just think about that. So for this specific industry, I know a funeral home director will be a specific job title. Or if, there you go, funeral director. Uh, let's just say owner, CEO. Uh, let's marketing director. Director of marketing, etc. So uh, for so for this you know specific case you know this is probably as big of a list as we're gonna find just because you know it's a smaller smaller service than normal so uh, just depending on your niche you know you'll have a bigger list but this is a quick rundown on how to use Apollo you know the filters you should be using if you're using the paid plan you can also filter by revenue size 
And if you're not using the paid plan, one way to filter by revenue size would be to filter by employees because just, you know, simple math, if they have, let's say over 50 employees, you know, they clearly have, uh, you know, solid revenue to support that, right? So I uh, hope this video is useful for you. Uh, and also what you're going to want to do after you pull your list. So what you can do is you can either use Apollo's, you know, paid plan and pull your list like that. Or what you can do is hire an Apollo scraper to get the emails for a lot cheaper, right? And then once you get your list, you're going to want to clean your list and verify the emails before you begin outreach, right? So I'll have uh, two videos here and here, you know, going over how to clean your list and then also how to set up an outreach system to reach out to, you know, a thousand plus business owners a day. So, all right, I hope this video was useful, useful, and I will see you in the next.